Hey everybody, SirXCR here with GamerFusion.com and Power New Gaming, and it's time to play us some Zombie Tycoon, Brainhoff's Revenge. Now, I've been wanting to do this game for some time, but my laptop that I had would not let me do it. So let's get this started. I've got a new mic and everything. I hope it sounds pretty good. So I apologize in advance if it's not. I'm hoping it is. I'm going to try to get it through Audacity and get it cleaned up, but the last few times I've tried to do it, it's not been too good. So. Let's go ahead and start us out with a new game. Uh, zombies. Ooh, this looks beautiful on this new computer. Mm. And I'm, I'm playing this on a 32 inch monitor slash TV, so Stinkerville. When I tried to play it on my laptop, it wouldn't even play, so it sucked. This is the apocalypse. It's the rabbits. Ooh, zom zoms. I can't I can't believe we get to play with the zom zoms this time. It makes me feel so much better. Look at the dude down there with his mouth open like that. There's our character, Brunho Brunhoff or whatever, Brainhoff. Brunhoff. This guy was just too slow, he didn't make it. Yeah, let's get him, let's get him. My minions. There's our boy. There's us right there. We got like the face mask on. Checkpoint. Hit the tab button. Okay. So I need to go here. Okay, we can zoom in and out. Okay. Press A and D to rotate the cameras. Okay. Okay, now what do we do? Skid mark, codex. The skid mark. Oh, we can kind of rotate him around and look at him a little bit. Origin, the first biomechanical monstrosity to roll out of Tycoon's lab. Skid mark is, a vora is as voracious as he looks. Much more, actually. An unstoppable war machine capable of mowing its way through a crowd of people living or dead. 13,000 hit points, DPS 232, it's level 1. Versus buildings is 232, movement speed's 500. Badger. Bear hug, brain, brain trust. Trustity is in that box. Oh, so we've got all kinds of like interesting things we can look at now. Let's get out of this menu and let's continue our gameplay. Select the unit by hitting three. Okay, we did that. Move the cursor toward the red carpet. Yeah, the pulsating blue marker over there. So we right click the move. Okay, so it's kind of like a real time strategy game, sort of. Before my old laptop wouldn't play this, it was like, nah, I don't want to play this game, fuck you. I'm, I'm not doing this. Ha! Leader controls, we'll go ahead and... We'll go ahead and move... Big man here up here. Ah. Zapped him. Damn right. It's doing an impressive speech, a mumbling, and... Sounds like... Is that Beaker? That must be Beaker. Like a very angry Beaker. Mm. Oh, there's people still in there, huh? We'll just tear them out of their homes. Squad 1. Oh, we need to move them up here. Okay, I see. We gotta attack this house. Come on, guys. Destroy it. Yeah. Kill these humans. Yeah, they're not going nowhere. Once captured, a house generates roaming zombies. Roaming zombies defend the house and capture nearby houses. Okay. Sweet deal. I like that. We need to go to these other houses. Can we do anything else? No, just with our our squadron. Yeah, let's get them. Come on, throwing boxes. What are these, the mailman zombies? Yeah, I think they're mailman zombies. Yeah, kill him. Destroy that house. Good, we've captured it. It is, it's almost like a real-time strategy. 
We gotta kill the cop. So this is a really neat game. I'm kind of glad I got to actually play it this time around. And just kill the humans off with their roaming zumzums. Reach the last stronghold. Oh, what are you? We're gonna go ahead and go around here. Oops. Oh! <laughs> the dude just runs into the wall! Yes! Run, my humans, run! No. Wreak havoc gonna slaughter all civilians with the Samurai squad. Oh, that doesn't, that doesn't sound fun for them. Can I hike? Oh, okay, so that's to rotate it. Come on, my, come on, my minions. I'm gonna slaughter them. Sweet! And how do zombies wield swords like that? That's what I don't understand. You would figure that you'd try to eat them and not just slaughter them with a samurai sword. <laughs> Alright. He's like a crazed beaker. It is so awesome. He's probably going to be one of my favorite villains slash... Anti, I guess an anti-hero, more or less. He's a hero to the zombies, but not to the humans. Wow, they're quick when you target them. Yeah, cut them down. New objective. Could capture the hardware store. Got it. This is a pretty interesting game, if, especially if you just want to play as zombies for once. Yeah, kill the humans. Slaughter them. In the name of Brunhoff. Sweet! We need to capture this hardware store. Definitely. No. The cops. Let's run around them. Come on, guys. Don't let them kill you. There you go. Yeah, there we go. I'll drink your zombies in the hardware store. How do you do that? Oh, okay. Oh, that's pretty interesting. What do we make out of that? Oh, nice. What kind of zombies are these guys? Move the cursor over the door switch and use it to interact direct quick command. Okay. Ah, I see. They can actually... It's like engineer zombies that can get into places. Oh, that's cool. You guys are dead. Why are you even coming out of there? Use the dead rush command spacebar to trigger a dead rush. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Yeah, uh, you're dead. Here, you're dead. At least one zombie in the squad must survive. Let's kill these stragglers. I think that'd be our best option to keep from our dudes from dying. Let's get some of these bad guys. Yeah, uh, get them. Get that human. Get him, get him. Yes. Okay, let's back off. Let's back off. More cops. Get these stragglers. No, oh, 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 don't want to lose a zombie. Let these other ones get in there and get, take some action, some hits. All right, guys. Good job. Good job. Go ahead and click around, see if there's anything else we can do here with zombies. With our engineer zumzums. What is it? Ooh! Whatever this is. Trophy, maybe? This is kind of like an exploration type uh, real-time strategy game. In the sense that you're not really building stuff. You're, I guess right now you're not, because this is just the training level. You might later on, but... 
Break through the gate and proceed. Doing just that. Alright. Huh! The zombie with the side glove just punched him. What the hell are those guys? The ghouls? Oh, they're goblins. They look like blue goblins. Wow. Get him! Oh, the one had some skill. Uh oh. These must be like the bad zombies, like someone else must be controlling them. It is. It's like a zombie. Ah, see, that's brain off. Okay. So who are we then? All right, guys. Well, that's the end of this chapter. I'm gonna go ahead and call it the end of this for right now. Hope you guys enjoyed zombies, zombie tycoon two. Brenhoff's Revenge. Yeah, I kind of forgot it there for a second. Who cares? Ah, who cares? Anyway, stay tuned for the next part of this. I'm going to do this by chapters. Hope you guys enjoyed it. This is SlayXTR with GamerFusion.com and Pirate New Gaming. Whoa. Ooh, that pizza's coming back. And it's it's fighting. It's it's coming now. Pizza's Revenge. Ooh. Oh my gosh, that hurt. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is SlayXTR with GamerFusion.com and Pirate New Gaming. And until next time, guys, this is Slayer XTR signing out. One more thing, guys. Remember to hit that subscribe button and the share button and the like buttons and all these other buttons and all over the place. There will also be annotations for the other videos that I've done, guys. So I hope you guys enjoy it. This is Slayer XTR signing out finally.